Hello, and welcome to HubSpot Tutorials by Webdo. I am Mike, your guide and friend. And our today's tutorial is how to analyze performance for individual pages and blog posts in HubSpot. You can analyze the performance of individual pages and blog posts to see how visitors are engaging with your website. If your page includes smart content rules or videos, you can see how the content is performing. Analytics will update every 20-30 minutes. In today's tutorial, we will show you how you can analyze the performance of your specific website pages. With this same procedure, you can also analyze your landing pages and blog post performance. In your HubSpot account, navigate to Marketing in the drop-down menu and click Website Pages. Hover over to any of your website's pages and click Details. To analyze data over a specific period of time, click the Date Range drop-down menu at the top of the page and select a time frame. The Performance tab shows detailed metrics on content performance based on interactions from contacts associated with closed one deals, views and submissions, etc. Page views the number of times this content was loaded on a web browser. Total form submissions the number of form submissions on this content. New contacts the number of new contacts created from this content. New customers are the number of customers who originally converted to this content that currently have the customer lifecycle stage. The average bounce rate is the percentage of sessions that started on this content and did not move to another page on your site. Time per page view is the total amount of time visitors spend viewing this content divided by the total number of views. This calculation does not include visitors who left the site after viewing only this content. Exits per page view the percentage of sessions that ended after viewing this content. Entrance is the number of sessions where this was the first content viewed. No data is available right now, but once HubSpot collects all the data, it will be shown in the above form. You can also filter the pages on the basics of page views, total form submissions, new contacts, contact to customer rate, new customer, bounce rate, and time per page view. That's how you can analyze performance for individual pages and blog posts in HubSpot. Thanks for watching. Feel free to ask any questions in the comment section, and we will be happy to answer. If you like the video, Give us a thumbs up and press the bell icon to subscribe to our channel. To know about our HubSpot services, visit us on www.webdo.com.